Okay. Uh, yeah. Um, all is fine. Frames not dropping. Okay, let's continue. It's a bit later than. And I just fiddle with the extreme elements. Why is it so hard for a bot to keep its name? Whatever, let's let's continue. Mm -hmm. Kabuki Mono's finale. But mono means like um something like peculiar character or something like that. Um Clear weather all around brightens the heart. Yeah, but now we're gonna make him remake. We're gonna go through Scarmouche's memories. I want you to know. We kind of know what they were. I want you to know what are the Wanderer's memories. What he thinks happened to him in the past. No matter what lies ahead, I'll face it. Oh, I, I, was, I talked to you yesterday. That. Remember a certain purpose? He can be the Bulladier, Harbinger of the Fatui, and he can be also the Kabuki Mono who was once sighted at in the Tarasuna. Uh, yeah, the Bulladier was his title. Uh, when did he start calling himself Scaramouche? Oh, or who started calling him Scaramouche and he kept it? This looks like Inazuma. Right now, you're in a dream I created using information extracted from your memories. These memories will show you the raw truth, but be aware that enemies may react just like in the real world. Please be careful. Sounds like an immersive experience. <laughs> it's a good thing we came along. You don't need to do this for me. I don't deserve your protection. We never give up halfway. Well, we had to once, but that was your doing. <laughs> And they're just finishing the job. All right. Thanks. Wanderer, this is the Shake Pavilion. In your Balladeer incarnation, this is where the Electro Archon placed you after your creation. Mm. You had a great many memories here. Is that because this is kind of like his birthplace? You could say that, in a sense. You'll see why shortly. I hear footsteps. This place is huge. Ooh. I can't believe the landslide didn't fill it in. I wonder who built it. The crystal marrow miners? No, there's no way. Look at this exquisite construction work, and so well preserved, too. No mining crew would be capable of this. Hmm? There's someone passed out on the ground. <sighs> Who are you? Y you're awake. What happened? How'd you get stuck here? A are you injured? Uh huh. Not a scratch. And these fine clothes. Who are you? This man is Katsuragi, deputy to Torichiyo's adopted son, Bikoshi Nagamasa. He found the balladeer in Shake Pavilion and took him back to Tarasuna. Where is Shaki Pavilion? In a summer or...? And the rest is history! Well, it used to be. In the original version of events, Katsuragi was ultimately killed by Nagamasa. What was he doing here? Let me get you out of here. 
Our people are nearby. Hang in there. During the Tatari Suna incident, Niwa was murdered by the doctor, disguised as a mechanic. The Balladeer, then known as the Kabuki Mono, disappeared not long after. As the second in command at Tatari Suna, responsibility for what had happened fell to Mikoshi Nagamasa. But Katsuragi had sworn lifelong loyalty to Nagamasa after the latter had once saved his life. At Katsuragi's insistence, Nagamasa killed him to put an end to the Tatarasuna incident. Ah, oh, that's why he died. But what would that end the incident? <sighs> Katsuragi seems like he was a good guy. He looks like a warrior. But he has a kind face. Why couldn't he live a long and happy life? Nagamasa, I found this young guy in a cave sealed off by a landslide. He doesn't remember his name. Well, we need to call you something. I hear the workers are calling you the Kabuki Mono. Hmm, that's fine with me. Katsuragi, report to Niwa. Tell him we have someone new joining us. Time to go. abandoned like you I lived here for a while at first but there's nothing for us here we can't stay okay uh, is that after he fled I heard my mom and dad used to make swords but the factory manager died and then my dad got sick <coughs> he kept coughing all the time just like me then mom started coughing too but you can't. You promised me. Yup. We're family now. We're gonna be together forever and ever. This child didn't have a name. Or rather, the balladeer didn't know what to call him. His father died before he could name him. Well, the kid remember his parents coughing, eh? How old people get before getting a name? After his mother died, the child stayed in their straw hut alone. Some of the neighbors helped to raise him. After leaving Tatarasuna, the balladeer ran into this child who didn't have a name, just like him. They made a promise to live together. What happened to the child then? He died from his illness while he was still very young. The balladeer came home one day and found that he had stopped breathing. Hey! What's wrong? Say something! You promised me we could be family! You're no different from Niwa and all the others. You betrayed me too. <laughs> The voices have gone. It looks like the memory ends here. Let's keep going. Oh, oh no, it's close.
You do realize you're blocking my path. I come not to obstruct you. I've been waiting. What you are truly is a weapon. One that could be wielded with an iron will. Or you will continue to drift in the sun. Are you trying to win me over? Long the fated rebellion has begun. Why not take your place at the banquet and join those who shall feast? Well met. Don't be a killjoy! The Temple of Wisdom! Positions! Put your back into it! Wind strategy! As one with wind and fire! This is order! Quake! It looks like I went too far. How old is this Jester? And the. Um. The, the doctor. That's this enough. place is dark. We've got poison on site. Paimon knows this place. It's the delusion factory in Inazuma. Yeah, that's one of the things I'd like to know. How does she and Miko remember? In the original version of events, the Traveler once encountered the Balladeer here. Mm -hmm. Such a creepy atmosphere. And so familiar. I remember this, it was in a certain place. Hey, look over there! Well, well, my fair lady. Is this rundown factory and these incompetent fools all for me? Wow, you shouldn't have. Huh. What do you have to gain from belittling your subordinates? You might not want to admit it, but you are a part of this plan. Perhaps you find fighting in the Abyss to be a more meaningful use of your time? Oh, but of course, even this pales in comparison to being experimented on by the Doctor. <laughs> what a sharp tongue you have. Funny how negotiating never seems to be your strong suit. For the task ahead, I suggest you keep your true feelings to yourself. Hmm. <laughs> Save your breath. I know what I have to do. I'm sure you think so, but I still think you need to hear it. Don't start thinking you're invincible, and don't let your emotions get in the way. Hmm. Yeah, if they had brought anyone back from life, maybe they could bring her back with that as well. Surely you're not worried about me. And maybe we will have met her in this timeline. I just can't have you getting in my way. You and Child never fail to find ways to complicate things. I'm merely lighting a little fire in this chaotic nation. But you, being tossed out like trash, must make you want to destroy it completely. Do you remember the last time you were here? That was a lot of swordsmiths you killed. I'm sure the descendants of the ride in Gokaden are still suffering the consequences now. Look at you. Oh, don't get so sentimental. Now, give that poor little tongue of yours a rest and stop pretending like you're above everyone else. Bye then. See you at the victory feast. Poor little tongue? <laughs> She's playing with fire talking to me like that. Who does she think she is? <sighs> Forget it. Someone might find me here any minute now. I should prepare to give them a warm welcome. I don't remember the other things. I thought she died before that. <sighs> Was it after? The plot does not end here. There is more of this story to come. Wanderer, are you able to continue? Yes. 
Please don't worry about me. Why are you staring at me in silence? <laughs> Can't you think of a nicer way to express yourself? I'm under no obligation to be nice to you. Besides, I thought nothing mattered to you except results in your own interests. Isn't that right, witch? <laughs> Muddle-headed puppet. You're only number six because you can take more abuse than other humans. Do you really count that as an asset? You're about as much fun to be around as a raging inferno. But before we murder each other, it'd be best if we finish our duties. <laughs> Stabilize! Commit it to memory! Dance with the wings! This is order. Looks like we've arrived in Sumeru. Uh, is that? Considering that Amorta's sage, Nafis, refused to join this project, I'll take part in the experiment in his place. Welcome. I look forward to a fruitful collaboration. <sighs> when do we start? You seem impatient. You should know that becoming a god is far from a trivial affair. The biological transformation is a lengthy process. As such, I too would recommend that we commence as soon as possible. In the event that a successful connection is established, his body will become permanently bound to the machine, and he will be unable to move independently of it. But is he biological? Nothing worse than what I've been through before then, Doctor. You were the most resilient test subject I ever came across. Thanks to you, I was able to garner a great deal of information. Alas, after that, you were under orders to remain in the Abyss. We barely saw each other, and it became difficult to further refine the knowledge I had gained. That was gracefully worded. Ever wonder what they'd think if they knew that nothing matters to you, apart from your crazy experiments? I suggest you speak to me in a more respectful tone, Scaramouche. The mere fact of your utility does not make you indestructible. The doctor again? <sighs> that was uncomfortable to watch. That person gives off a very sinister energy. It's the doctor, she's behind all of this. It's normal for him to give you the creeps. He scares the bejeebers out of Paimon. <laughs> Let's move on. Hey, we could walk there. Uh. You're a god. Do you think I'm evil? If you accept that he is you, just as you are you, then yes, you are evil. No, um, if he still thinks like that, otherwise he was evil. In your eyes, are there any differences between humans and puppets? Do you think there are any differences between your present self and your previous and future incarnations? If not, then what are the differences between humans and puppets? 
Whoever has tasted the joys and sorrows of life in the human realm is human. Whoever has loved and lost, cried with grief, howled with rage at the tragedy of death that eclipses the miracle of life, they are human too. <sighs> I've seen enough of my past. If possible, I'd like to reclaim the sins that are mine to bear. No matter the consequences, I won't run from blame or punishment. Whatever I am due, let it come to pass. Insane. Can you return my memories to me? Huh? But won't that mean you lose your current identity? I want to know this guy's backstory. I've always believed that human lives follow a set of rules. With each person being a collection of past experiences. As a puppet living in a human world, my life is subject to the same rules. Regaining your memories means reverting completely to your previous incarnation. All the emotions that you discarded will return to you. Are you sure you want to do this? I've lived with the void in my chest my whole life. My creator didn't need me. And ever since I awoke, I've just drifted from one place to the next. But then I met you, and I finally realized that reclaiming my missing sins might be my one opportunity to become my true self. Okay, so he'd never stay long anywhere to have any actual history. So this is from me, also where you learn about swords. A person can erase themselves, and even though the original blood you has gone, this person will live on his place. A person seems an inescapable part of their destiny, too. I've always felt I have an innate tendency to yearn for something more, in a way that goes deeper than for most people. But for all my soul-searching as a Shugenja, I've never fully understood it. Looking at it now, it seems that I brought this curse upon myself. Mm, Shugenja was the word for puppet. I don't remember. So I beg you, grant me this opportunity to gain a purpose, to change my destiny, and end my wandering. Very well. Uh, so Since your mind is made up, I will return to you that which is yours. You have made your decision. Now. Take this. <sighs> Set him free. A puppet? What's he doing here? <sighs> it's... You're human as far as I'm concerned. Everyone's here. Wonderful. What a fine blade! Nagamasa will be thrilled. This is... my... Is he alright? Dross will be purged. That's why this won't be the end.
what? Uh, this is trying my right. patience. Have you got all your memories back now? You got any more stupid questions? Oh, whoops. Hang on. Uh, Wanderer or weapon? Oh. Hmm. Uh, yeah, we never saw him with anything, but I thought I sort of would kick him. Okay. Oh, let's see. The wind rises. Feeble human. Oh, he stays. Oh, he stays in the air. What? Oh, he stays a lot. I haven't tested him in here. Squall fury. At my command, on the gale, you shall fall. Are you right? Oh damn, I don't... Nothing I'm gonna die here. Yeah, there's not a nice place for me to test it. Uh, let's feed him. Insignificant past! My endless cycle begins! The wind rises. Oh. Squall and fury! Feeble human! Unsightly insects! No wonder he got wings. Behold! Insignificant past! Is there a minion? Like, he's free now or something. <laughs> The wind rises. Churn! Feeble human! Behold! Know your place. Okay. Imbecile, get out of my sight. It disappeared. Did we win? Okay, he's got his attitude back, but he was not. What did you expect? I never song. lose to that. <sighs> There's the tone of voice again. You're definitely back to your old self. She just saw some memories of him. She doesn't really remember. Wait, but it was you inside that thing too. What have you got to be smug about? Sorry, I'm harsh on myself and everyone else. Just the way I am. Now you've recovered your memories. The best will catch up with you. <laughs> you sound like you're concerned about me. But don't worry. Thanks to you, even if I didn't change a thing, at least I now know the truth. The memory recovery seems to have been a success. This dream has served its purpose. Come on. Let's continue this outside. Hmm. Myself in the lab. Well, I think now it's almost over. Welcome back, Traveler, Paimon, Balladier. <sighs> it feels like we just went on a really long journey. Paimon's exhausted. 
You don't like being addressed by that name? It's fine. But I was just thinking, I should probably change it. Well, well, but I'm not here anymore. Well, he remembers, but he's not one of the Fatui anymore. It wasn't that his Harbinger name. What After Scarish? learning about everything the doctor did, there's no way I can carry on using a name connected to him. Mm. I'm not planning on returning to the Fatui, and they wouldn't take me back anyway. Recent events will have affected a lot of people, and they might not even remember who the sixth is. Mm. Wouldn't that probably be? Uh, uh, no, the did the past. Uh, I'm I'm not sure. Did the past change? Or did they did he that did that or just everybody at the present assumes he was like that before? Do we have any evidence of him? So uh, you're quitting the Fatui for good? Let's go to let's go on the street. <sighs> it's like you said, Lesser Lord Kusanali. Everything may look futile, but it wasn't completely meaningless. At least I made a lot of people forget about me. But that doesn't mean your own past has disappeared. Mm. Of course. And your main goal, for which you gave up everything you had, you weren't able to achieve it. I hope you can see and understand that. Changing the world, changing the past, changing the fates of other people, these are not simple things to accomplish. What you are looking for is complete annihilation. But this is just a fantasy. Even if the Balladier is removed from existence, the world will not heed your will. Indeed. <laughs> How ridiculous. Do you regret doing all that when you've gotten so little in return? Even if I'm completely worthless, there's nothing in the world worth regretting. Lesser Lord Kusanali, you purposely left that information in Nermansol. Didn't you? Yes. And I took pains to make sure that you'd acquire that information naturally. Why would you go to such lengths? You trying to win me over too? In all honesty, your past experiences have made you a useful asset to Sumeru and to me. Winning you over was indeed a part of my plan. But before that, I wanted to tell you the truth about your past. If all I wanted to do was use you, then I'd be no different from the doctor. Very clever. I guess you could say that's one of my virtues. Utility to others is what gives me worth. So if embracing my sins is what it takes to make me useful again, so be it. I think that doesn't see you in that way. Oh, right. I almost forgot. You're the good guys. You're into justice and all that. Sorry if I have a slightly different perspective on things, but I don't feel like I've been duped. The wisest leaders are fated to end up with the best helpers. I can live with that. I'm glad you're able to think of it in that way. Traveler, in the future, I'll continue to search Ermansoul more deeply and see what secrets can be uncovered. Including the beginning of your twin's journey recorded in Ermansoul. What exactly happened before and after that point? I want to know as well. Thank you. Let's hope you can find some answers. I will try. Traveler. Yeah? After I dove into the information torrent in Ermansoul, why did you go to Inazuma? Because I wanted to know what you've changed. Um... So that's how you found out whose fate had changed. And how. Well, whatever your reasons, you did me a favor. And I'll do everything I can to pay it back. 
Mm, I need to do all this for reward. This makes it sound like I'm extorting. Borrowing and returning are the only real relationships between individuals. I'll balance the books one day. Don't you worry. That's not true. A relationship between two people is not simply a ledger that can be reset to zero. I think deep down you realize this. People who show up in your life don't just evaporate like water drops and leave nothing behind. There is no such thing as balancing the books. Some things in this world can never be brought back, and they can never be changed, which is why there is emotion in the human world. Everything that you feel is real and lasting, and whatever is missing in you will not be made whole. To be human is to live with imperfections. You can choose whether or not you want to be human. Hmm. But humans can't live without a heart, can they? Anyway, I gave up trying to become a human a long time ago. You understand what pain is perfectly well, even without a heart. You're just bearing your feelings. The past is set in stone, but you can keep moving on. And the longer your future lasts, the shorter your past will become, until one day... It is but a tiny fraction of your life. Sounds like you've got a future planned out for me. Mm, I hope you can give the need a chance. Everything's ended up being pretty darn complicated. Paimon doesn't even know where to start, but... The most important thing now is that you need to follow Nahida. Otherwise, all our efforts will have been for nothing! So, shouldn't he be dangerous instead of animal? Why did he got that? Then I guess I'll be helping you from behind the scenes from now on. I'm glad that you've accepted our proposal. Why don't you choose a new name to celebrate? Hmm. So he won't be the blunderer. Oh! <laughs> Why? Because... Because... Paimon still doesn't like you that much! <laughs> then I hope we don't see much of each other in the future. A name is life's first gift. You didn't say it out loud, but I know that's what you're thinking. <sighs> the Traveler and Paimon have helped you a lot. If you can't decide on a new name, maybe you can ask mm. them for ideas. No! Paimon only does nicknames! If it's a serious name you're after, it's all yours. What? Well, an actual name? Uh, have you got anything? I have choices. Oh. Rules and display for name. I'll be actually able to write his name. Oh, come on, I couldn't name a Pokemon that was temporary, you know, I can name him? Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Name change rooms, you can obtain an item, an appellative stroke. From the Arkham Quest interlude in version of the Genesis, which will allow you to change Eons Adrift. And that's his uh, constellation, right? Animal... Wanderer Animus name. Wanderer Animus name. So there may be other wanderers in the future. Or maybe he'll. Oh, well, he got a vision now, but so he's not human. There is a possibility he could have more than one element in the future. He did have Electro before. Even without a vision. Uh, please take note that some names cannot be utilized in this change. Okay, I can't curse. But once you have renamed his, this character, some interface in the game going forward will display the name that you have chosen. There's a limit on the number of times you can rename this character. Oh, oh good, so you can rename more than one at least. So, those always care. Disclaimer, travelers. 
Please ensure that you follow our terms of service and use the function to create a healthy game environment. Please read firm that not instigate a <laughs> party in the creation, the content discriminates against any race, chain or religion, sexual orientation, ethnicity, government or region, the bullying or instance of any travelers or groups of travelers, any other behavioral aids. May I restrict your use of the game service and not follow these rules? This may include suspension, restriction, name, a name reset, forced disconnection, and suspension or comfort. So you should start with a name reset. What if you curse somebody in a language you don't know? Uh, at the same time, you're welcome to use the report function to send feedback to us should you encounter the information situations. Okay. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, damn. I, I wasn't ready for it. Uh, I think it should be a Japanese word name, probably. Oh, what was he? Uh, uh, what's the name of the quest? I am now. Some, something mono. Kabuki. Kabuki. Just Kabuki mono. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I, I was. I meant to see what Kabuki actually means because I don't know. Uh, uh, kabuki meaning. Yeah, I'm not gonna add another screen here just to show something that I hope won't be too long. No, what does the word Kabuki mean? No, no, the actual meaning of the word. Uh, was late. Was late. Google. English. Japanese. That's right. Kabuki. Switch. Okay. Three kanjis. What are they? Song. Uta. The second one is dance. Mai. And the last one is ki, which is why no okay key is like skill or something this one i know or three isn't yeah but this isn't the condition for three that i know uh, okay so we got sing uh, kabu is singing and dancing okay 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 it doesn't sing oh there was some story about him dancing wasn't there Okay, so let's use the dancing. Just dancing is my my okay a dance of wind. Okay. Uh let me yeah. Uh, uh. Kaze. Okay, that's the tension for Kaze. Uh, Kaze. Kazamai? Wind dance. Okay, that should be his name. Kazamai. That's good. Apparently, I can change it in the future. Okay, but I like it. Kaz. Yeah. Okay. That'll be his name for now. If I think of a better one, I'll change. Are you Wind sure? Dance. No. Not at all. You caught me by surprise. I think it did good. Uh, yes, I think it did do. Oh, all right. If you say so. Yeah. It may be wrong. Maybe now you have a name of your own. isn't really like that in Japanese. But it works. I don't know. It doesn't matter. What about a nickname? Are you done yet? Oh, guys. Uh, I'm still thinking. Stop. Take your time. I don't need to see you again until you've thought of one. <laughs> what do you plan to do next? Everyone who manipulated me and made me suffer will have to pay the price. Oh, hang on, could I name him? Just left as Wanderer. It was written Wanderer at the first action. You mean the Fatui? Um... The Doctor. At least. Now that your stance has changed, 
I believe your future path will change accordingly. But it won't be immediate. You still need some time to compose yourself. Hmm. One more thing. Oh, damn. I just thought about something. What this Karamush means, I don't know. Karamush, this Karamush. We will do the Fandango. Of course, most of the entries are about him. Uh, a movie. Oh, Wikipedia. Karamush. Let's see. Uh, uh, I don't want to move you. There's a move post for move. There's a negation. Stop come character. Uh, Scaramuccia from Italian means little skimsher. Oh. He's kind of short. Uh, is a stock clown character. It's a clown. Uh, Scaramouche is a clown. Okay, I, I think I went a better direction. Uh, it would take me longer. There are still some descendants of the Raiden Gokuden living in Inazuma. Some of them know. Well, they ought to know about the connection between Raiden Gokuden and myself. No. They are. Okay, they. I don't plan to leave Sumeru for the time being. If you see them in Inazuma, please tell them that I was the one responsible for the Raiden Gokuden's downfall. Mm. Even though the events have been erased from the world, they still deserve to know the truth. Okay. I see. That is up to you. Huh? But if we do that, then... You'll be a wanted criminal. It's fine. Let them stab their blades into my chest if they so desire. Maybe that's how it always should have been. Would he die if you stab him in the chest? They keep saying he doesn't have a heart. Fine. <laughs> No nonsense. I like it. All right, let's call it a day. Goodbye, wise deity. And you too. He's gone! What he went through today would have been like living an entire lifetime in an instant. He'll need some time to calm down. Yeah, true. But even so, after everything that's happened, he doesn't seem quite as fierce anymore. There were some bumps along the way, but it's all over now. So we can finally go eat? Paimon is starving. Thank you both. I hope you will find somewhere nice to go and relax for a while. Well, we could take her along. We would probably get a free meal if we took her along. Now it's over. Yeah, there was about an hour or so to go. I've got it! I can end my novel with some words from Mikoshi Nagamasa. You mean because everyone else in the story <laughs> is dead? Yeah, I heard that Mikoshi Nagamasa died at a ripe old age. He's the perfect fit to be the narrator of the epilogue. Oh yeah, they had it written, actually written, and it was erased, so yeah. Physical evidence of his existence did change. So he must have changed the past. The dark clouds had dissipated, but they continued to cast their shadow in Mikoshi Nagamasa's mind for decades to come. Then, one night, as an old man, he had a dream. On the night when that prized blade, the Daitatara Nagamasa, was forged, the people rejoiced, and there was painting, dancing, and drinking. Mm. All these expressions of joy melted down in the furnace fire and turned into red clouds that rallied around the final sunrise that Mikoshi Nagamasa saw in his lifetime. Life 
is a story too long to be told. A journey that you must walk to behold. <sighs> Oh, I can talk to you. Akaba, thanks for inviting me to research together. Of course, Sawada. Your creativity has been indispensable to me. Without you, I'd have scratched my head bald by now. You see there? <laughs> Can we meet Kazuha anywhere? We got Child and Yoi Mia there that time. Time to go. Oh, she's here. Thank you so much. Please get some good rest. You must be exhausted. You know, take a shower, take a duke duke. You'll feel good as new. <laughs> Okay, let's go back to our rented house in Sumeru. comes rushing back. So I'm all, I'll buy some delicious treats as a reward. Wow, great! Huh? Look at that vase. For a moment. Did someone break it while they were cleaning the room or something? But Paimon doesn't remember there being a cleaner. Do we drop it? Then I was staying here found bumped at the table after being started. My son to do the Baladir and broke the vase. But the Baladir erased his existence. He changed the world. So why is this vase still broken? You sound lost and confused. She's hearing that too? Who's that? I know why you are troubled. Any who knew of this would find their mind overwhelmed. Huh? Is there someone here talking to us? Unfortunately, the fate of Tevat cannot easily be changed. Perhaps a god may have a slim chance, but for anyone else, <sighs> who can say? When a small animal runs into a tree trunk, though the tree may sway, it is not displaced. The same is true of fate. Like a vase that falls to the ground. Whether it is broken by a cat or by a bird, the result is still a broken vase, is it not? Uh, who are you? How do you know about all this? History does not change easily, but human hearts can. Believe your own eyes. Only that which you see is true. What is unseen is but an illusion. The voice has disappeared. And who the heck was that? And what were they doing coming out of nowhere and saying all that scary stuff? Believe my eyes that she made. I should trust my memories. Ugh. Anyway, that face is still lying there broken on the ground. Should Paimon go get someone to clean it up? No, you should clean it up. It feels wrong just leaving it there. Just a moment, Paimon will be right back. Is she unable to hover closer to the ground and clean it? 
I wonder what else awaits me in the future. Well, Inversion of Genesis. Ah, uh, the item to rename, re rename him. Unification. Wish me to maybe install a new name upon a certain person. Once the new name has been given, it cannot be changed. Okay, so I have one shot to change it. But I think I'll keep the one I gave him. I, I can like it. Yes. Wherever in this world I roam. Let's go I to remember. in a zoom and check if I can tell the the guy at this myth that change. Uh it's a name what's the name? A name was something. Uh, I follow the wind. An a middle man. Okay, it's not a name. Okay, I. Or no, no, no. Huh. Gonna. He just told me to tell them about it. If I came here before. The quest and would it work? Is there anything else I can help with? No more about it. I'm in the marge. Running over thing. It's still ancient times. Running past so far to discuss these poems. I don't know if I ever read that. The techniques. This is one of them. Certain ways. Learning tricks. How the source and place in the zone. Well, most of us have mastered the sort of cell. Two merchants, straight steel, put it on zoom, okay. But I don't have an option to tell him about. Yeah, I never had this dialogue with him. Uh, okay. No, I should be able to tell him. I was sure there would be a new option here. Uh, and then if it works, then I would go to Kamisato's place to see if I can talk to someone there. Well, okay, let's make the wish and see. I probably won't. Yeah. Poor guy, he probably won't get many wishes this time. But I'll Yeah, I'll probably spend everything I get when once this is ending if I don't get him. Alright, I'm gonna stop this one here. Yeah, it took about an hour I guess to complete it. And one of those days I'll start playing the card game. The essence of the Ame Noma art is to have the patience to move mountains 